Hello everyone and welcome back, my name is McBeachBuys. Today I have for you a nice, easy to make item elevator for Minecraft 1.11. The design is simple and easy to make, it uses low amount of resources for the redstone, and it is incredibly fast. The maximum speed of this elevator is 5 items a second, 300 items a minute, or 18,000 items an hour. This is limited due to the speed of hoppers. With two hoppers inputting into the dropper, it does that maximum speed of 5 items per second. However, the speed of hoppers is 2.5 items per second. So with one single hopper input, it will do 2.5 items output from the elevator. However, with two hopper inputs into the dropper, it will be able to continuously output an item into the elevator itself through the dropper. This allows for it to be activated at its maximum speed of 5 items a second. To build this elevator, you're going to need some hoppers for inputs into the dropper, the dropper itself, a redstone comparator, a redstone torch, an observer block, five pieces of redstone, some building blocks, and glass to build the elevator shaft. First start by placing a dropper facing upwards onto a block. Have a block coming off that with a comparator taking out the signal from the dropper itself. Then have a block coming off the end of that comparator with a redstone torch on top of it. Come down underneath your comparator there and build a small platform with your observer block facing away from where your redstone torch is. That way it is detecting, I've got a resource pack on so my observer block looks different, but that way it is detecting the redstone away from the direction of where the torch is. Then place some blocks in that wrap around the side of the observer block, it doesn't matter if it's at this level or if it's the same level as the block. And then simply wrap your redstone around the side. And that's basically all you need to do. Then you can just add your items into your dropper and it will immediately start dispensing. To turn this into an elevator, simply build a 3x3 square around the top of the dropper and then make this as high as you need for your elevator. Then simply just add your inputs for the hoppers. And that is your elevator done. This clock design will also work for sideways droppers, not necessarily just for an elevator. Thank you everyone for watching, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video and found this tutorial helpful. Be sure to let me know down in the comments if you guys find any different ways of doing the circuitry, I'm always open to suggestions. I'd also love to hear how you guys use this design, whether it be in your own elevator or any other uses for the circuitry with the dropper. And finally, make sure you're subscribed for more awesome videos like this one as well as some other content. But that's about it, so thank you guys all so much for watching. I really hope you all did enjoy, and I'll see you next time.